Hello, it's Coach David Halal um, from uh, Certified Life Coach David Halal YouTube channel. Again, we're continuing with the uh, attraction, um, how to get a girlfriend or boyfriend, you know. Um, this video, I wanted to uh, make sure that we... Um, Talk to the man first without the women getting angry. Um, it's very important for as men to know our role, our, our, um, our position, if you will, in this world. Because television, the media, you know, quote unquote, talk about the modern man, the modern man. You know, a man who who's all, who who is sensitive, who is weeping. You know, um, who's not strong enough, who who share his responsibility with his woman fifty fifty. Nah, not true. Uh, there's many reasons why this is important. There's many reasons why, but the the most important reason, or the one that. Uh, the most important reason that we should always focus on is that a man must be a man for the woman to be a woman. Because if the man is not on the masculine side, strong side of the spectrum, then the woman have to compensate. You see? Compensate. It's kind of like if you're missing a body part or function of a body part, then other body parts, other functions in the body will take over just to compensate for what's lacking, for what's missing. You understand what I'm saying? So uh, that's extremely important for the men to be the men. So this video is a specific. It's a specific kind of newly evolving, evolving man, uh, a strong man, uh, uh, a man, uh, um, or I should say this man is, is not only strong, Right is he's not ashamed of being who he is. He's not embarrassed. He's uh, a man who is unabashedly uh, masculine. Do you understand? Uh, uh, you remember back in the days when you watch Clint Eastwood, when you watch movies like um, um, James Bond. You know he is strong. It don't matter what he's going through. If the enemy is about to kill him, he is cool under pressure. And he approaches his women or women with confidence, not afraid, not being um, weak. You know, in his approach because he knows what he wants. You know what I'm saying? Now, everybody's looking for love. That's one of the things I want to say. Everybody's looking for love, men or women. You either trying to get love. And if we already receive love, we want to give love. So it's either we, we're trying to get or we're trying to give. Because love is a circle. It never ends. That's why God presents himself or introduces himself as the circle. When he talked to the book, in the book of Ezekiel, he says, you know, you know, a circle within a circle. Because a circle has no end or no beginning. You know what I'm saying? Uh, women talk in circle. You know what I'm saying? So, so, so uh, the universe circle, yourselves in your body circle. I mean, everything in the world, even you, even if it might seem square, but but within it, there's a bunch of little circle because circle is love, circle is is light, circle is is strong, is powerful, is omniscient, omnipresent, omnitemporal. You know, cir circle is 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 is, uh, is life. So we are trying to give life. I mean, to give love or receive love. Um, this man, this uh, powerful man, the the evolving uh, evolving man, the strong man, is is purposeful. He is he is confident in his approach. He is again, you know, um, uh, uh, strong. He is powerful, and we're not talking about the old style, you know, a uh, macho stuff. But we're talking about a man who knows who he is, you know, who doesn't disrespect women. You know, a man who is integrous, who is humorous, you know, when it needs to be, but can be serious at any time while he's being humorous, when he needs to be, 
When he needs to protect, he's a protector. When he needs to provide, he's a provider. A real man. A man. Um, so since, me, since we are trying to give love, trying to receive love, we must know who qualified to receive our love. And who is able to fulfill us or to give us the love that we will put. Because when you sow love, you should receive love. And if I'm sowing, let's say I'm, I'm sowing corn, I don't want to be receiving you know, pumpkin or, or some other, you know, thing. I want to, if I give love, I want love back. You understand? And love come in different shape, different form. Love come in, uh, you know, we'll talk about that another time. Let me not enter that, um, you know, highway because love is powerful and it's, it's strong. It's a, uh, you know, but anyway, that man is an ambassador. He's brazen. He's audacious. He's humorous. He's integrous. He's you. Um, he leads his household and uh, spiritually. And I'm not talking about religious only, but I'm talking about all kind of spiritual, you know, direction that that he wants his household or people in his environment. He leads at all times. He leads not only by his word, but especially by his action. He leads um, um, with a, a commitment. With a, um, he has a heart of commitment. He is spontaneous. You know, he can handle himself. He can fight. He can be also, you know, very playful. He can be very loving. He's very romantic, but he is not, um, 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 you know, a wimp. He is not a, a weak link. You know, and in the word that we use the P word, he's not a you know, uh, but anyway, so he is a powerful man. So now we not we need to understand as men, since that's what we are. But um, uh, when we need the when we approaching the one that we love or the one that the one that we uh, the women or women when we approaching women and uh, those we are trying to date, you need to uh, know that. As being because you are men and that you because you are very purposeful and driven, you need to also know that the woman has a different aspect or it's, it's on the difference uh, on the opposite side of the spectrum that you cannot go as forceful, as quick, as fast as uh, women because we are different. We are different gender and nature. God has created us, uh, formed us differently so we can balance each other you understand so 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 that's very that's very important you know um this man uh, as a man you need to be able to take your woman you know sexually to ravish her you know to 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 make love to her to 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 um to please her but when you are approaching these these women you know the women that you want to talk to you gotta uh, go slow you know, you have to move uh, slow, but let your desire be known. Now, when I said go slow, I don't mean to go talk to them and, you know, and want to be friends first and no, let your desire be known. Let them know that you find, you know, when you approach your woman, the woman of your choice or women of your choice, when you go to them, let it be known that you find them incredibly attractive. You find them sexy. You find them, you know, hot. You know, let them know that you, your, your intention, your intentions are strictly romantic. Because if you try to deceive yourself, trying to act like you want them, you know, I want to, we just, you know, I'd, I'd like us to be friends. Then you're deceiving yourself because really what you want is not to be friend. It's not to be friends. And I've learned that because um, then it becomes a, a, a burden for you to, you know, finally. And then a lot of times when they find find out that you were really interested in, you know, um, in them romantically, they feel deceived. They feel deceived, you see. Um, so you should let your desire be known. And then once you let your desire be known, once you tell them, you know, I find you incredibly attractive, you know, astonished, hot, beautiful, sexy, and I would like to, uh, we should go out sometimes, you know, sometime, you know what I'm saying? Um, and then ask them, you know, proceed to, 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 to let your desire be known. Now we're going to stop here because I don't want to um, make this video too long and YouTube give me a hard time 
when the videos are too long to load them up and things like that. So I'm going to stop here and then we'll continue again with the next part. Uh, this is Coach David Halal, fearlessly and passionately teaching you from A to Z, pursuing my call and my destiny. That light make my eyes look watery like I'm crying, but I'm not crying because I am a man. See you later. Don't forget to subscribe, like my videos, share with all your homies, your friends on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, this and that, the other, all your contacts. See you later. Bye-bye. Peace.